Do you currently use WordPress and want to pivot your website to an e-commerce platform? Jotform's new Storm Builder can help you accomplish that with no coding necessary. Hey Jotformers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly. And before we jump into the WordPress side of things, I wanna give you a quick idea of how to build your store builder. So I'm in my Jotform dashboard. Up at the top, I'm gonna to go to my forms, then we're going to click on my apps. Next, we're gonna click on the purple create app button in the top left, and we can either start from scratch, we can use one of the templates, or we can even clone an existing app if we already have one. For this example, I'm gonna go ahead and use a template. Now, one of my favorite templates is the barbershop one, but of course, you can definitely utilize our categories to search for one that's gonna work best for you. Choose this one and then use the template. Perfect, so we can already see that this barbershop app has a product list included. If you were starting from scratch or using a template that didn't have a product list, all you need to do is go over to the left-hand side where it says add element. You're gonna choose product list. We'll go ahead and drag it in. And the best part about this is you can have multiple product lists within one app. So maybe you're selling products and services, you can do this as well. So for example, if we go ahead and click on the product settings, we can add different products. And the same thing, if we come and we edit the product that we already have here, we can take a look at the options. So we have quantity. So if we want to allow people to purchase more than one of something, or if we want to add options. So let's say we're selling shirts, we can choose the color and we can add in different colors like this, red, green, blue, yellow. And since I mentioned we are selling t-shirts, we can also add another product option to have t-shirt size. Perfect, so you can see we have five color options and we have seven shirt size options and we are good to go. So we can see that we already have this product list selected and we can see we have the store settings here. If I X out of this, it goes away, but we see it up in the top right corner. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose this one right here, store settings. And this is where we can add that payment gateway. I'm gonna go ahead and click the button. You can see you can also search for what you want. I'm gonna go ahead and connect my Square account Good deal. So one thing I wanna do before we go over to WordPress, I wanna change the name of this app because I already have Barbershop. We're gonna do this one Barbershop too. Perfect. So let's go ahead and head over to my WordPress. The first thing we want to do is we want to add a new plugin. So over on the left-hand side, I'm gonna choose plugins. We're gonna to go to add new, and then we can search for Jotform. Perfect, we take a scroll and you can also physically type in Jotform shopping cart, but this is what we're looking for, the Jotform shopping cart for e-commerce. So I'm gonna go ahead and install and activate. Perfect, so we can see that it's installed, it's active, and it has the auto updates turned on, which we definitely want. The next piece with this is we get to choose where we want to apply our app. So it can be on a page, or if you have a blog, it can be in a post. It's totally up to you. For this example, I'm gonna do it on a new page. So I'm gonna come over to the left. We'll do add a new page. And I'm gonna start just with a blank page. And we're going to click the plus sign right here. And we can see Jotform Shopping Cart is right here. If it does not show up right here, all you have to do is just search for Jotform and it'll populate for you. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose it. Then we need to choose which store app we want to utilize. And you can see it gives me all of the apps that I have created. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose this first one, the Barbershop 2, and we'll click Done. And we are good to go. So all we need to do now is just preview. So I'm gonna come up here to Preview on the desktop, perfect. And here is our app embedded in our website. It is as simple as that. If you have any questions about creating your store builder or embedding it in your WordPress, please let us know and I'll see you next time.